Hello friends, Tony here, welcome. So we are in the post now and we don't have data from a database here. We haven't worked with the database yet and I want to prepare the front end first. So I want to also create a form. So we need a form to store data in the database. We need to fill a form and through that form we can send data to the database. For that I'm going to open the flow byte and here on the scroll i want to search for forms and let's see uh, input field and the post field i have a title and the description so here we have also sizes if you want the default one is this one so let's copy the default one and i'm going to open here the create page so create blade inside the resources views post and in here i'm going to add first the div with some classes so this div is going to be max uh, with show excel mx auto and let's say also p4 and inside i'm going to add the form element and inside the form element i'm going to add a div with a label for the title so we have to change that the p title and, uh, in, and the input and then also let's see for the text area which we need for the content description so let's copy this and let's create a div and inside the div add that one okay so if I zoom it a little bit out yeah here we have form a div and I'm going to apply the same classes also to this one which we added the text area and the same one I want also for the button so let's add the div with the class to be margin bottom of 6 and here let's add a button and we can scroll here to find the button I'm going to choose the default one so I'm going to copy that paste it here and this button is going to be type submit not a type button okay let's save and let's see how it's going to look so open the project let's navigate in the slash post slash create we navigate through the URL I'm going to fix that right now and here is the form because I'm I am in the dark mode so if I change the light mode here yeah uh, let me just change something in here I'm going to add the BG to be yeah I'm going to choose slate 200 on the dark mode it's going to be slate uh, let's choose uh, 900 and also I'm going to add the rounded P large let's save and let's see now yeah now we have something like this if I change that to dark mode we have something like this and just we need to change also the body so let's open the layout and inside the body tag I'm going to add classes so it's going to be BG slate 100 or white you can say and on dark mode I'm going to say it's going to be BG slate 900 now from here not 900 but 800 and yeah now it's going to look like this yeah but uh, the header is not looking very good so let's fix that go to the create and here we have the header so let's add but cut and add this inside a div. Okay. Not some classes here. So class padding of two text is going to be slate seven hundred on dark mode. I'm going to change that to be text slate uh, 200 and also on this 
div and we add some classes. Margin top of four. And let's save. Come here. And yeah, here we have. If I change now the light mode, we have something like this. Okay, good. Okay, now if I go to pose, yeah, we don't see nothing here. And let's go and open the index inside the pose. I'm going to fix this, just the heading, because the others I'm going to leave for now. And for the heading, instead of adding the same classes we have here, what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut this. And let's open the components and create a new component only for the heading. So I'm going to say header.blade.php, paste that in. Now instead of post create hard coded here, I'm going to cut and say dollar sign slot. So here we are going to render what we want in if we use this header component. Let's close. And now let's use in here the x dash name of the component is header and inside I'm going to say post create page. Just let me navigate there. Slash create. Just yeah, now we have post create and we can use also that on the index. So instead of this one, we can say, I'm going to cut the post index and use that x dash header inside, add the text you want and then go to post. We have here post index page, good. Okay, so now I want to add a link to navigate the post create page. So for that, let's open the create and I'm going to copy the button here or just copy the classes and go to index and here I'm going to add a div or let's say a section and inside the section I'm going to add a div and inside this div I'm going to add this button or on link so anchor tag with the shrift to be slash pose slash create and I'm going to paste the classes we have copied from there and say create. Now if I save that, yeah, we have this create page, but what I want is the heading right here. So on the right position, and we can fix that because we have added a div here by applying a class with flex and justify and let's save. Now we have that here. If I click, we navigate the post create and post index. Okay friends, so that's it all about this video. I hope you enjoy and if you like such videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like the video and share with your friends. All the best. Thank you very much.